Hello, old friend. Been a while, hasn't it? <laughs> I bet you're wondering what became of our vault hunters. Let me tell you a story. After the death of Handsome Jack and the fall of Hyperion, Pandora was at peace, as much as it ever was. <laughs> their mission complete, the Crimson Raiders set their sights beyond the stars. You remember the Vault Key, right? It had that map with all the crazy floating holograms. The Vault Hunters believed it would take them to vaults across the galaxy. Of course, sometimes when you're busy looking forward, you forget to watch your back. I do not understand why we haven't left Pandora yet. We are nowhere closer to finding the vaults. This map is the most important scientific discovery in all of human history, and Mordecai is using it as a coaster. Does that matter? We don't even know which planets these are yet. I don't like flying blind. Sanctuary's holding together using spit and wishful thinking. She's barely staying in the air, let alone leaving the planet. Well, we gotta do something. People are talking about disbanding the Raiders, saying Pandora don't need us now that Jack's gone. We need a leader. She don't want the job, man. And can you blame her? Sometimes when you're the one calling the shots, people get hurt. Not making a choice is still a choice. So then, we have no plan, no working ship, no leader, and a soda can on the vault key! Lil, we need to make a call. What do you think? Ellie? That ain't the engines, Lil. This is Lilith. Sanctuary is under attack. All civilians evacuate the city immediately. Crimson Raiders, to me! Keep it up, Vault Hunter! Lilith, there's too many of these pendejos. This is Lilith. All Crimson Raiders fall back to HQ. Just tell me where to point this some bitch. Come on.
time to change the world. Whose soul is this? You all right, killer? Money. I got as many people off Sanctuary as I could, but it was Man, kind of a rush job. Looks like I scattered the Crimson Raiders around the area. Lovely. Those weren't bandits that attacked us. They were trained They're soldiers. Well, and that gas, it turned people into monsters. Find us a base camp while I look around for the others. We'll rally the troops and take back Sanctuary. Seems without your man rolling, y'all turn into a pack of baby racks with your tail barbs tucked between your talons. <clears throat> so here's what happens now. You've seen what my paradise gas did to your people. Next up, all of Pandora. Sure, it'll kill everyone on the planet, but every garden needs its fertilizer. Well, he's a dickhead. But he's right. Roland never would have let this happen. Sanctuary was the pride of Dahl's mining fleet. Seems to have fallen into disrepair. I hope you don't mind, but I've already made some upgrades. Here, I'll say it for you. Incoming. one of all. Oh. <sighs> 
sounds of bloodthirsty murder, and I love it. Whoever you are, mystery bandit, kill, kill, kill those fine freaks and turn that tide. Hey, how's that tide coming? Is it still turning? Heck yeah! Slice and dice those reaping creepers, my mysterious savior. Nice job. Some sort of clown themed novelty bar, enjoying weak old pizza and watered down booze. It was a hell of a lifestyle, folks, but it made you soft. In my experience, an army rots from the top down. I led my people up from ruin, gave them something to believe in. That's why they follow me. We are New Pandora. We're the men who split our backs on the promise of paradise, but it was stolen from us. Now we're taking it back. Start with your ship and your key. Now paradise is coming. And if I have to choke the life out of every last person on this planet to get there, then that's what I'm gonna do. Not get all shooty at me, okay? Uh, my name is Vaughn. Uh, now I know we're supposed to be like, you know, mortal enemies or whatever, but I don't know, the enemy of my plant monster enemy, right? Sure. Hey, looks like Hector kicked you out of your home too, huh? Well, I guess we better join forces. Welcome to my camp, the back burner, huh? Look, Hector's vine freaks could be back at any moment. We better secure camp, Vault Hunter. Backburner's firewall got knocked out. And I'm talking an actual wall of fire. We gotta reset the security relays to get that <gasps> firewall of flaming! You know, uh, I actually opened a vault once. Went from Hyperion accountant to vault uh, guy to bandit war chief. It's a long but very touching story. Hey, I'll tell you about it sometime over some questionably sourced meat. 
Me and my bandit clan were living over in the wreckage of the Leo station, and Hector shows up and orders us to give him our moonshot cannon, but we said, hell no, we won't, bro! And then that, that didn't work out too well. We tried fighting off Hector's new Pandora soldiers, but we were no match for him. And I probably should have armed my clan with more than presentation-grade Hyperion laser pointers. <laughs> Lesson learned, I guess. Me and the survivors regrouped here. We were getting ready to retake Helios when Hector launched a gas attack and turned everyone but me into Vine Freaks. Now that dude Hector's walking around like he's Mega President King of Pandora or whatever. You know, Pandora's like air or meat or underwear. It's meant to be shared. Relay. We'll have that old firewall a flaming in no time. And if any of my clans survive, they'll come running when they see a fire. <laughs> they always do. It's hilarious.
thought I'd team up with a filthy, smelly vault hunter like you, but desperate mind freak gas turning times call for desperate measures. Screw that home thief, Hector. You and I are gonna mess that dude up. Blood pact! What's up, killer? Good work finding a camp. Guess this will be our home while we figure out how to take back Sanctuary. Uh, this is my camp? Hey, Liz. Step back if you don't want to get any bandit on you. Let me easy, know easy. if anything catches your <laughs> We can share. Hey, hey want to take a spin of my lucky underwear? I'm listening. I'm going to teleport back to Sanctuary and try to take Hector out. Maybe there's still time to fix this. gonna happen. I can't get to him. Sanctuary's flooded with that gas. Tannis, can you, I don't know, whip us up an antidote? Of course. I will first need to discover the nature of these mutations. Send me some plant genitalia. I believe they are called flowers at your reading level. What she said. Let's get it done. Tell your friend, Marcus Munitions. Welcome, customer. So you cowards teamed up with that bandit from Helios? Figures. They gave up their moonshot cannons real easy. Now I can launch my paradise gas wherever my eye can see. Adapt and reuse. That's called strategy. You know, if you ever want to taste victory for a change. I'm so ready to kill that guy. Get Tannis those samples, killer. I'll keep rounding up the raiders. Tannis, I couldn't find you after the attack. You somewhere safe? Oh, yes. I'm secure in one of my many hidden panic shelters. Handy when you live in a constant state of panic. Enough small talk. Get me those samples and we'll have a plant monster army of our own in no time. We just need an antidote. <sighs> Fine. Honestly, sometimes you people make no sense whatsoever. Get Tannis those samples, killer. I'll keep rounding up the raiders.
find yourself hitting harder while fighting within a gas pocket. Strange, but potentially helpful. Do keep a close eye on your exposure level. Unless sprouting vines and losing your mind is a newfound kink. In which case, I have some echo novels for your perusal. Judgment-free zone. Look for closed bulbs. I need pure specimens. I see the gas has infected the local fauna as well. Vault Hunter, try obtaining samples from those infected skags. Pandoran standards. It's unlikely that this gas is naturally occurring. Someone engineered it. designed to increase biomass at an exponential rate. In dumb speak, gas make tiny plant go big big and do the ouch. an understanding of advanced biogenetics I can only describe as brilliant and arousing. Now we must discern how the gas is infecting humans. I will require samples, specifically brain matter, which I like to call that good gray stuff.
infected. I gained absolutely no information from those infected scabs. The scientific method prevails again. <laughs>
A breakthrough! We all know that the Pandoran atmosphere is chock full of benign spores. The gas mutates the spores already present in our lungs. Oh, wonderful. The spores spread to the brain, taking over the nervous system. The subjects are left nearly mindless, like a slag huff addict or a music enthusiast. I have disappointing news. I lack the expertise necessary to synthesize the gas and create our own legions of plant-human hybrids. Again, not doing that. You sound just like that university ethics board. No matter. Return to the back burner and send me those samples. I'm running out of iridium, so I'm gonna make one last sweep for survivors. See you back at camp. creature. Dissect it with your weapon of choice. Like I always say, the more horrifying specimens, the merrier. Well done! Pointless, but well done. Welcome to my humble shop.
Good luck. Send me those samples as soon as possible. I've made every preparation and completely disrobed so that there is nothing between me and the laboratory-grade mylar of this biohazard suit. The sensation is very satisfying. That's on me. Yeah, um, I was scanning my glutes for reasons, and, uh, and I busted the science thing. <laughs> Just give it a little bandit high five. Scanning bio signature. Oh, I love that sound. Vault Hunter, over here. Tannis is working on an antidote. In the meantime, let's find a way back up to Sanctuary. Yo, Lilith! Me and Talon got a nice perch up by Mount Scarab. We might have found a way up to Sanctuary. Mordecai, good to hear from you. I wasn't gonna let you fight this one without me. Well, crap! Brace yourselves! Bunch of Hector Salad soldiers ahead of your way! Welcome, Ellie! Customer. It's time for a fight! Remember, Those defenses ready? Could use some help getting more turks I online. BH, Dark there's Dark a bash range on the table over there. Grab it for me, will you? Those things will fix anything with a few thwacks. I set up a badass choke point just outside of camp. Get them turrets humming, Vault Hunter. <laughs>
like a vault hunter, but you totally fight like a bandit. And that is the highest compliment. Tannis, any updates? Well, I cannot produce an antidote, but I have traced the gas to a scientist named Cassius Leclerman. Whoa, Cassius? I know that science, dude. I'm gonna call him now. Yo, Cassius. Hey, it's Vaughn. Vaughn, uh, hello. Uh, I'm rather busy on a secret project. Gotcha, gotcha. Super quick question. Uh, did you plant Monster up my bros? I would never plant Monster up your bros. Hector swore that... Ah, oh, I see. I've been tricked into working for an evil megalomaniac. My bad. Hey, happens to the best of us, bro. Come to my secret laboratory. The entrance is through the old doll mine. I'll begin working on an antidote immediately. I got eyes on the mine, Lilith. I'll let you know if I see anything. Keep me posted, Mordecai. The Vault Hunter will meet you there. Mordecai's new bird. I think he's trying to tell us something. What's that, Talon? Mordecai got attacked by vine freaks. Vault Hunter, follow Talon!
Hyperion recommends channeling your post-death frustration into pre-death vengeful anger. Dirty Sniper has captured an endangered animal. Just thinking about how scared and confused that bird must be makes me so mad! That's why I'm sneaking into his camp and freeing it. Let this be a lesson, fellow eco-warriors. Direct action works! Let's go! There he is! Poor defenseless bird. Hey, hey you beautiful